stories again. Don't we just love stories again? So we might as well just like cut to the chase and talk about. <coughs> Here we go again. Hmm. Talk about um, the. Um, okay, we met these illiterate people, uh, these guys and a girl. Uh, uh, and there was another girl, but there was uh, she was out of the equation um and so um what continued from there our relationship with these Ill illiterate boys uh <laughs> but what what they that, that i'm not trying to put it nobody should put anybody down for being illiterate it's just that um they what they may what, what they lacked in literacy they gained in other ways. So, yeah, let me just continue the story. Uh, let's see now. We left off at... Uh, where did we leave off? At, I don't know, because we, the video had to be cut short. <laughs> you know, because, you know, there's like... The, the landlords are so greedy that you can't get uh, enough power into the... The video camera to power the the uh, video. So, uh, yeah. Well, that that's not your problem. Okay. So anyway, uh, we we wound up uh, every Friday afternoon. We would pack up whatever camping gear or fishing or hunting. Uh, depending on the season, if it's spring, it's going to be a lot of fishing, and in the fall, it's going to be some hunting. And we would uh, pack up uh, shotguns, uh, fishing rods and reels, uh, sleeping bags, uh, grub, <laughs> and, 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 you know, whatever. And uh, the Vietnam veteran man... Um, would uh he would he, i can't remember if he'd stop by our house or we'd go to his house and pot would drop us off somehow or another everything was thrown into the back of a 1964 um ford pickup truck i think it was a ford uh could have been a chevy uh it was one of those two and then um just go roaring down the highway to get the hell out of the ugly city and to the beautiful country and the way we would go it would be uh might he might have like one one or two of his kids in the cab and then the rest of us in the back of the pickup so it was a gang of us boys uh just being hauled out of the city into the country and we would go, uh, then we'd go set up camp, and um, sometimes, uh, oh, well, they, so they had this trailer, uh, where him and his wife would stay, and um, I don't know how they ever made room for all of us, but uh, we, we sometimes would all be uh, camped out there, but most of the time, he would leave us at the campground next to the river, uh, and we would be uh, set up tent. We 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 knew how to make because uh, me and my little brother uh, learned from Boy Scouts how to set up tents, and uh, we we all uh, we made some kind of arrangements to cook a bunch of food. And plans to go fishing or hunting the next day, but um, I, I'm just assuming that um, they, that those people's, uh, those guys' father, uh, he went to uh, stay at uh, the trailer, which was a half a mile from the river or a mile. It could have been a mile, uh, and. Um, stay with his wife um that they had extra rooms so if things didn't work out work out with um oh, uh, 
that, oh, that's that's a real bad one. Worn out, <laughs> worn or worn out. <laughs> any any who, uh, so that it, the uh, older girl, the firstborn child, uh, the girl, if things didn't work out, uh, she could always you know return and have a back room in the trailer. Uh, and they had, a, they, like I say, they had a, uh, some kind of operation where they were competing with another um, operation that sold m mostly uh, fishing tackle, they call it, uh, and it's just snacks and Coca-Cola and B BS that they would sell. And um, they would they would be... Uh, it, and and I, I remember uh, staying in that trailer. I don't know how they made room for all of us, but they did. And um, then, uh, so yeah, time to cut it short. It's six. Bye.